Hello, my awesome Cappies. Cappies, happy Sunday. So it's Sunday morning, YM. Cappies, I hope you're going to have a relaxing day with your loved ones. Um, Cappies, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. We're also going to check what's coming towards you and what you'll be dealing with facing. First, we're going to ask how you're doing uh, and what's coming towards you and how you're doing on your soulmate journey. We're all on so many journeys. Um, second part of the video, we're going to ask about your person, your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. And we're going to ask how they are currently doing, how they're feeling towards you at this time, and what's on their mind currently, what they're thinking, feeling, especially in relation to you, Cappies. Universe, please step in, show very clear. And important messages for the sign of Capricorn. For Capricorn's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming towards Capricorn? What will Capricorn be dealing with, facing? And how is Capricorn currently doing on their soulmate journey? <clears throat> One extra message, very important. Wow, this is you holding on to your soulmate. Uh, so it's like... You have a hard time uh, communicating with this person. Uh, holding on uh, is something that you want to do because you care for this person. <clears throat> but it's like your sound judgment is telling you maybe you should let them go and see what happens. And your heart is holding on to them. Uh, this also shows another very important message. That has nothing to do with your soulmate. It's about your job or business. Um, yeah, there's a lot of chaos at your job or business you're dealing with. People uh, not agreeing, people gossiping, fighting. Mm. I'm very curious to see what will clarify this. Yeah, this is you. Very diligent worker, detailed, skilled worker. Whether you have your own business or work for somebody else, you're showing up here as very diligent, skilled, resourceful person. This is you <clears throat> waiting on some kind of communication to happen between you and your soulmate. Let me see what's going on here. Yeah, this is you. You feel like you are on hold right now trying to figure out what to do about your job or business and also your soulmate situation. Let me see. In a few minutes, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of while watching this video. For most of you, it's your romantic interest or partner. Universe, please show us what's coming towards Capricorn. What will Capricorn be dealing with facing? And how is Capricorn currently doing on their soulmate journey? Wow. You are sad about your soulmate. This Cappies, you are sad. Yeah, this is you. Yeah, this is you wanting to reunite with them, reconnect with them, spend time with them, but you're not sure uh, how they're going to receive that idea. This is you waiting on communication from your soulmate. You've been waiting. Uh, you're not happy with the people at your job or business. So you, you like what you do, but... The people at your job or business create a lot of drama, gossiping, drama. Mm. Yeah, you see, this is you feeling depressed. Some of you are almost depressed with your uh, work situation because of the chaos that's going on, bickering. You want to reconcile with your soulmate. You love your soulmate. Of course you love them. You are very good at what you do. Whatever it is you do for a living, you're very good at it. Yeah. You said about your soulmate. So you're not with them right now. But look at this. This is you. Very connected from past lives. So if you feel this connection, so do they. You're very connected. Past life connection with this person. Wanting to reconcile with them. Hmm. You're holding on to your soulmate. Yeah. Let's see what's going on here. Universe, please show us what's coming towards Capricorn. What will Capricorn be dealing with facing? 
yeah your soul may be showing up here as in and out of your life in and out of your life uh some of them are either at a distance from you or traveling yeah so again work stuff showed up over here with people bickering you thinking maybe you should uh leave the place mm, have new beginnings yeah this is uh, stressing you out the situation at your job with um, toxic people is stressing you out huh let's see we're gonna ask in the extended reading about that let's see let's first see what's going on with your soulmate currently universe please step in show very clear and important messages for the sign of Capricorn for Capricorn's highest good please universe the soulmate of Capricorn the soulmate of Capricorn What's going on currently with the soulmate of Capricorn? And how is the soulmate of Capricorn towards Capis at this time? And what's on their mind? And this one wants to come out right here. Two of them. Why? I don't know. Two of them, not one. Oh, this person is not letting you go. Lovers, especially in position one. This person is not letting you go yeah they want to put work into this so they they see that there was not enough work put into this relationship for it to work out yeah you see you see these bare pentacles on behind their head and the third pentacle they working on this person wants to be with you put work into this yeah you see they know what they need to do because this is reverse two of pentacles you see what's missing is communication you see the sword is pointing down they feel this is unresolved for them a lot of you are dealing with gemini and also um libra yeah they have not given up on you this is them holding on yeah see holding on hoping wishing praying for something positive to happen so you guys are connected from many past lives here you have the star symbolically part of the universe holding the two of cups reminding you too that you two love each other on a soul level for many lifetimes so this is a continuation of your soul journey together yeah this is a continuation a lot of you are dealing with aquarius and also sagittarius let's see virgo showing up very strongly also universe please show us <clears throat> how is the soulmate of Capi is currently doing and how are they currently feeling towards capricorn what's on their mind yeah you see so here's that pentacle they're working on and here's that pentacle they want to bring into this connection king of pentacles is serious energy it indicates long-term commitment that they wish to have yeah you see again nine of wands from two different tarot decks this person is not uh, given up even though they feel exhausted tired stressed out yeah so somebody walked away somebody walked away whether you did or they did or you both mutually walked away from each other somebody walked away yeah i see this is long-term commitment four of wands that's what they were hoping for hmm long-term commitment they stressed out this is them stressed out not sure if it's gonna work out or not see just like you had it six of cups they have it also this is them reminiscing of you thinking of you missing you yeah you see they realize that you are the one that they want to be with so maybe this breakup needed to happen for them to realize how important you are to them this person would like to see you this is my favorite page when it comes to communication because page of pentacles represents important communication like face-to-face -face communication which is the best way to communicate face-to-face especially when it comes to resolving misunderstandings, not communicating for a while. Uh, this also means um, gifts, peace offerings, apologies, um, uh, important telephone conversation. This person is very stressed out. Hmm. Let's see what's going on here. You must please show us how is the soulmate of Capricorn currently doing? And how are they currently towards Capis? Magician. So they want to manifest this. Yeah, they slow to action though. 
uh, very grounded, slow to action, but this is the only knight that I trust, knight of pentacles. Wow. This is them dealing with a lot of stress in their life as well. Yeah, well, life is stressful, right? Life is very stressful. We just have to know, uh, see clearly what it is that we need to work on. And the stuff that is beyond our control, we cannot worry about. Yeah, we cannot stress over things that are beyond our control. Yeah. Capis, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about your soulmate's true long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. Then we're going to ask what they're hiding from you, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle this soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life whether it's your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family members, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Cappies, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.